Hello, Scorpio. It's Malady from Malady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly weekend. Re no, sorry. I'm coming to do your weekly reading for. Okay, somebody has been trying hard to get rid of somebody. So maybe somebody has been trying hard to get rid of you for a long time. It seems like somebody trying to find a nicer way to do it, or they just got to go through the whole legal process to have it done. This may be done towards you. But it's Milady from Milady's Way Terror, and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of August 7th through 13th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. So somebody want them to op somebody wants you to open your heart. But you care about somebody else, and this person that's trying to get you to open your heart is emotionally draining for you. All right, so make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. I don't know if I said I'll read the Cleo cards to close off. Let's get this show on the road, okay? Let's go on. What's going on for Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio? What's going on for Scorpio for the week of August 7th through 13th, 2017? Love reading, love reading, reading, love reading. Scorpio love reading, August 12th through, no, August 7th through 13th, 2017. All right. Jesus. All right, so there's some third party situations going on here. Oops. All right, so some guy, it might be a workplace thing. Yeah, I feel like somebody is trying to protect you from, from seeing whatever this situation is. Okay, so it seems like It seems like somebody is intentionally overstepping their boundaries and doing stuff to you that you don't like just to piss you off. All right, yeah, so this person is emotionally draining you. This whole issue with the third-party situation. Okay, so I feel like somebody is offering you gifts to kind of like calm you down yeah I see you actually receiving gifts but you want to be free from the situation no somebody wants to be free from you whoa okay let's take it from the top here so there's a third party going on so this could be both sides you could have a third party and somebody else does I feel like the third parties have to do with somebody at work or maybe it's just three of you together that work together you know, y'all got some little third party thing going on at work. But it seemed like one of the people in the third party is intentionally trying to piss you off or somebody off to get um get get you to leave. Somebody wants you out. So one of the people wants you out so they can have the other person all to their self. Yeah. The gift parts, we're going to have to clarify that, but it's start, all starting to be emotionally draining to you. This might even be you trying to get the other person off. And I feel like this presence, it might be you trying to bribe, bribe them to leave because you want to be with the person for yourself. But it's like, they don't want to. They don't want to leave. They want to be a part of the whole thing. But you just want one of the people in there. You're like, okay, what? Well, I want you gone. You know, you trying to do everything to get them out or this could be happening to you, you know. Mm. Yeah, I feel like this might be happening to you. Yeah, I think you about to get kicked off the, uh, I mean, it's a general reading though, but I'm going to say it like this. I feel like you about to get kicked off the island, okay. All right, right now you're not feeling too good about yourself because I feel like you know that they're getting ready to kick you off. They're not treating you the same. Okay. Mm. 
Okay, what's going on for the Scorpio? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. What's going on for the Scorpio for the week of August 7th? Ooh, through the 13th. August 7th through 13th, 2017. What's going on with the Scorpio? Love reading, August 7th through 13th, 2017. Mm, somebody is feeling trapped. And they got a love offer coming in. So it's like if you are the one that's getting ready to get kicked out, well, you won't be out in the cold for long because somebody is, is going to come swoop you up. Okay. All right. Yeah. So somebody, they made their choice. The choice is made already. Either you make your choice or the group, somebody is being kicked out. Okay. Wow. Okay. So this makes me feel like some they gave you money to go. That's this present down here. Like, okay, we don't want you here anymore. You know, we like you, but we love each other. Mm, yep. That's getting ready to come out. Ooh. Yeah, the work situation. Okay. Okay, this could be a relationship, but this could be somebody getting fired from work also. Okay. But a third party situation. I think the full the most people is gonna affect this, the people in the relationship. You know, but I feel like once you leave, you're gonna be happy. So we're gonna take it back from the top. Sorry about this, but um, so we have the third party relationship. Maybe it's somebody at work where you um been working together on a project and these people have been, they've been making it seem like they're protecting you, but in reality, they, they're holding you back from what you need to be doing because they feel like you are uh, annoying in some kind of way. And you trying your best to be what they want you to be, which is uh, un, uh, emotional. I mean, it, it's being like, it's emotionally draining to you, but it's like they talking crap about you behind your back. And now it's just like they maybe somebody getting some kind of severance check because now, you know, they found some way to get rid of you. Some way to get rid of you. But I'm going to read these out the book. So we got the nine of coins here. The nine of coins says, uh, many of your dreams are approaching. It may be it may now be time to gain in realization of your goals. So basically. You're getting ready to come into something that is better. You know, you're going to come into money and you're going to be placed where you should be. Okay, so let's go with the moon card. The moon, the moon, the moon. Where is the moon? Oh my gosh. All right, so the moon is reversed. Frequent mistakes and emotional dilemma. So that's this card. And I told you. This one, that's the emotionally draining and this the sanctuary. Like, they feel like you're just not good enough for this situation anymore. So they want you out. All right, so the three of coins is upright. It says, it may take some time to get what you want. There will be much needed, much need for work and skills to succeed. So it's like you still got to try to a chance to stick around here for some of you that already haven't been booted off. You just got to oh, make just start paying more attention to what's going on. That's the only thing I can say from this point. Then you got the 3 of cups. Three of cups, three of cups. All right, so the 3 of cups says hmm <laughs> A problem has been solved, and it is now time to celebrate. Enjoy the moment, favorable outcome predicted. So it's basically like, it's some shady stuff about to go down, but in reality, it's all for your own good. So that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Thank you guys for watching. Have a nice week.